According to Forbes, more than 80% of Fortune 100 companies host hackathons to create strategies for advancing their products. Not only that, but last year, the government of India gave almost 2 crore 10 lakh rupees in funding to the team that won the ONDC hackathon. Many startup and entrepreneurs have developed revolutionary ideas and products by participating in hackathons. If you are a college student, you must have heard about events like this happening within your college all the time. But if you haven't participated in any of these events till now or want to know how to get started as a complete beginner, then this video is just for you. In this video, we will take you through the top 5 hackathons destined to happen this year, along with a strategy for you to increase your chances of winning these hackathons. But before we do that, make sure to subscribe to Intellipad's YouTube channel and hit the bell icon for more such informative content. The very first hackathon that I have on my list is an event held by the Government of India, the Smart India Hackathon. The main objective behind this hackathon is to cultivate a problem-solving mindset among the Indian youth and produce innovators and entrepreneurs within India. The hackathon is generally launched in December and the theme usually covers a wide range of sectors including healthcare, agriculture, education, smart cities and more. Winners of the hackathon receive cash prizes and certificates from the Government of India. As part of the Smart India Hackathon 2019 Hardware Edition, two groups of students prepared implant devices that can predict cardiac arrest way ahead of time. And they took home massive recognition for themselves and their projects and a cash prize worth Rs 1 lakh. If this sounds appealing to you and if you also have a great problem statement that you want to solve, then make sure to check out the Smart India Hackathon's website and get yourself registered immediately. Bharatiya Antariksh Hackathon 2024 To celebrate National Space Day, the Bharatiya Antariksh Hackathon was launched last year, which invites teams of three to four students from all levels across India to tackle challenges in geospatial domain, space science, image processing and AI ML. ISRO's primary motive behind this hackathon is to generate successful business models from innovative ideas from the Indian youth. Last year's winners received a whooping cash prize of Rs 1.5 lakhs along with certificates and a chance to present their solutions to ISRO and other experts. If you want to participate in the hackathon and want more information, you can visit ISRO's official website and gain valuable insights. The online hackathon on DARPG challenges participants to address issues faced by our citizens using anonymous data sets of real grievance reports submitted by citizens. Team can be of up to 5 members who must be 18 or older and can develop solutions such as speech to text transcription, development of AI ML models like chatbots or topic clustering as well as UI UX improvements. The winning team will be awarded a cash prize of Rs 2 lakhs. If you are interested in participating in this hackathon and want to know more in detail, you can navigate to the Innovate India website and register yourself. Keep in mind that this event will be conducted online. NASA International Space App Challenge The NASA International Space Apps Challenge invites global coders, scientists and innovators to use the open data from NASA and its space agency partners to tackle Earth and space challenges. This year's theme for the NASA Space Apps Challenge is climate change, focusing on tech solutions to reduce its impact. The hackathon is open to beginners and professionals and teams of 2 to 6 members can participate. Winners receive tech gadgets, software licenses and opportunities for mentorship and networking with industry experts to further develop their solutions. For a detailed overview of the inner workings of the hackathon, you can visit NASA's Space Apps Challenge website. Hack MIT 2024 Hack MIT, one of the largest hackathons in the world, will take place on MIT's campus from September 14 to 15. The hackathon is open to all undergraduate students. During the hackathon, workshops from sponsors, personalized mentorships, and fun mini activities will be conducted to allow hackers to take a break from all the heavy coding. Participants can work on sustainability, education, interactive media, and healthcare projects. Team can contain up to four members who can compete for various prizes, including a surprise prize, which will be announced closer to the date. If you think this hackathon is for you, you can navigate to the Hack MIT website for further instruction and register immediately. Alright, so now that you know which hackathon you should look out for, let's look at some of the top strategies that developers typically use that help them win the hackathon. Starting with, find the right problem statement. Your idea should be genuinely interesting and unique because your idea is going to help you attract and impress the judges. If your idea manages to impress the judges, 
chances are they likely support your project for further development make sure to clearly explain why you're building the project as in what problem does it solve highlight the significance and urgency of the issue that your idea is solving your main goal here should be to convince the judges of the potential behind your idea secondly you should have a clear idea of your target audience or in other words for whom you're building it you need to showcase your understanding of the difficulties and problems behind your problem statement and how your solution can innovatively solve it Lastly as a cherry on top you can tell the judges about how you plan to attach a commercial idea to your project as in how will your project generate revenue or add value in the commercial context present a whole road map for the monetization here is a pro tip judges look for projects with real time application and sustainability beyond the hackathon build the mvp the minimum viable point is another crucial aspect Although 36 or 48 hours might seem long enough, once you start with your project, you will be so hyper focused that time will surely slip away from your hand. Hence, it becomes crucial to concentrate on developing a functional model or at least a prototype that demonstrates the core feature of your idea, like the UI UX part or something solid that you can present. There is absolutely no point in developing features for your application that you cannot even show the judges. Remember, the goal here is to lay out a solid foundation of your project that can be built upon rather than the perfect complete project. Plan your game. A successful hackathon project starts long before the event itself. This is a very important point that has the potential to significantly increase your time management. You need to take considerable amounts of time to brainstorm and optimize your idea in advance. This will provide you with a clearer picture of how to utilize and divide your time to perform better at the hackathons. Remember, at the end of the day, time management is what ultimately increases your chances of winning. Make your presentation stand out. Do not underestimate the importance of presentation. The way you pitch your idea can make or break your project. You will not get a lot of time to go through all the nitty-gritty details of your project. So make sure to highlight the most impressive and innovative feature of your project. Here's another pro tip. The goal here is to sell your idea, for which you should create a compelling story around your project. You can start by describing the whole journey of how you came up with the idea and finish it off with how your idea can solve the problem. Remember, hackathons are not about perfections. There is no right way to do a hackathon. So focus more on the learning and the networking part. Lastly and most importantly, do not forget to have fun. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like the video and subscribe to Intellipads YouTube channel. That's all for the day. Thank you and see you next time.